And what is up everybody? I am so excited to announce that I have teamed up with the Holy Stone Drone Company to bring you guys this video. So make sure you stay tuned through the whole thing to find out how you can get a 10% discount at the Holy Stone website right now and give yourself a cool little drone for the holiday season. Now let's get into the video. Complow. Okay, what is up all you beautiful people and welcome back to the Mosh Mob channel. Now almost exactly a year ago to the day I posted this video above my head. It was a video about the Holy Stone HS720E. Now this drone, I was super excited to get. I was really excited to get out and fly it and show you guys how it worked. And because of you guys, that video has become one of the number one videos on my channel. And because of that fact, Holy Stone reached out to me and offered to send me one of their free drones if I agreed to make a video about it. So that's what we're here to do today. I'm super excited. Let's get into okay, it. Okay guys, here it is. Here is the Holy Stone HS440. Before we get into it, just take a look at this case. The case comes with it. It's really nice. It's got a handle on top of it. Really nice. I'm not going to lie to you guys. This isn't the first time I've opened this case. I had to open it and make sure the batteries were charged and it had batteries and a controller. So this isn't my first time opening it, but this is my first time opening it on film. So let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, here it is, you guys. Here's what you get when you first open the case. I didn't change anything up besides I took everything out of the packaging. So I made sure it was charged. Now you get two batteries with it. You get a controller, which is pretty decent size, you know. It's got a flip up thing, so you can include your phone in it. Pull it up out of here for you guys to see real quick. Now this thing is really cool. I don't have anything to compare it to. I didn't bring my HS720E out with it. I do plan on making that video comparing this HS440 with the HS720E because this is basically the pocket size version of the HS720E from Holy Stone. This is the Holy Stone compared to a lighter. This is the drone itself compared to a lighter. As you can see, a size example. And it's really cool. Let's go ahead and pop it open. Wow, it really does look, look just like my other drone, just smaller. Look how cool, it's got a camera in front of it. You can see this is the front side of it. And the wings fold out just like the other one does. It was really cool and satisfying to open that. Now let's see what they have to offer in the case. As I said, it comes with two batteries, and in here, it comes with two charging cables, one for each battery, and I just took these and plugged them into my uh, portable battery. They plug right in, USB, and they connect right to the batteries themselves. Here's what the batteries look like. They're pretty interesting. They plug in right there on the top right there. That's where these ports can plug in, on the very top. They go one way, you plug them in just like that, and then to unplug them, and then obviously USB. So it offers that, and then it comes with, obviously, an owner's manual and some extra props, and a screwdriver to work on it. So it's got the owner manual in there. I did happen to read that, so I knew how to start this thing. I did charge a battery, so we're going to try to get this thing up in the air. I put batteries in here. I'll show you all the little bits and pieces on the controller and how to start it. Let's go. Okay, everybody, so we're going to go ahead and get this battery plugged in real quick. It's a really cool battery, and it slides in right the back side right here, just like that. It's pretty awesome. The camera is this way. Now, if I know right, there is a switch on here somewhere. Okay, there's a battery right there. Just click that on real quick. It comes on, the light's on. Now I'm going to turn the controller on, and it beeped. It went dee dee. Now, if I know right, you got to push the left joystick up and down yep see so it made a noise now the next thing you want to do is push both joysticks to the right bottom that should calibrate it after you push both joysticks to the right bottom it should be calibrated and now the next step is just push both joysticks to the center towards you so the right joystick is going to go to the bottom left and the left joystick is going to go to the bottom right and that should start up the drone see there we go it started up the drone it's pretty awesome now all you got to do is lift off now it says it's got a one button takeoff so right here it's a one button takeoff at the bottom right of the controller it should be able to take off just like it is right now i got it up in the air and it seems it is a bit there is a bit of a breeze today, I'm not gonna lie. So it got up in action, and there's no 
yourself fly. You kind of got to fly it all by yourself. And I'm not going to lie to you guys, this feels more like a toy than a drone you would use for like getting cinematic views, but it's built for getting cinematic views. From what I hear, it's got a camera on it that's really decent quality, and we'll try that out in a minute. I'll connect the app because I downloaded the app so that we can actually try it out. But like I said, it comes with two batteries. We'll just see how much flight time it can get. Really quick and nimble. Like it's agile, that's the word for it. The drone is really agile, it turns really quick. See what I'm saying? It turns really quick. That's really cool, that's interesting. This is a neat little drone. This is a really neat little drone, I like it. I like that it's pocket size, it gets right up. That's interesting. So let's try to land it over here. Let's go ahead and land it. Go ahead and land, guys. Okay, first things first. You want to switch your airplane mode on and you want to search Wi-Fi for the Holy Stone FPV and it'll have some numbers after it. As you can see, that's what mine is right there. So I'm going to go ahead and connect to it. After it's connected, you want to go ahead and go back to your home screen. And the Holy Stone app you want is the Holy Stone FPV. It's a blue one. It has a blue logo right there, as you can see. So I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. Now there is a login sign up page and you, there is a choice to just skip right past it. And that's what I did. So enter device. Now right around here, it says Holy Stone FPV. Would you like to find and connect your devices to your local network? Just click okay, allow. And as you can see, that is the camera on the drone so we're go, gonna go ahead and get it connected and i'll record with my phone so you get some actual footage from the holy stone itself my phone so we are recording so i'm gonna go ahead and take off which is again these two buttons the two sticks down to the middle and that should take off and here we go now there are, other, are some other options on the app see how quick it just took off it just immediately just just wanted to go. It's pretty awesome. There are other options on the app that I want to check out. I've heard there's some things that this drone can do. Like, uh, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure this drone can go into orbit mode. And a few other things. I'll have to check it out. I'll, I'll have to do some other research. I'll have to do some more research on the drone and find out exactly what it's capable of. But. What you're seeing on screen right now is from the Holy Stone drone, the HS-440. Now I'm pretty sure you can make the camera tilt. Can I make it tilt? Okay, tilt a little bit. Oh, that's, okay, that's down. That's up. <laughs> it's hard to try to control it while operating it. I won't lie, I gotta get the hang of it because my other drones are all gyro calibrated, like they'll just sit there and not do anything. But this is a drone, you gotta keep flying. And right now, it just wants to keep flying backwards. You know what I like about this drone compared to my other drone? I feel like with my HS720, there's a lot of setup, like there's a lot of setup time. Compared to this, you kinda just pull it out and uh, it's there, it's, it's ready to go. Okay, so I really like how quick and nimble this drone is. I love how you can kind of just take it out, set it up and let it go. It's really interesting. And like I said earlier, it does feel more like a toy type drone to me. So if you're looking for just a really amateur beginner type drone, this is a drone to get. Holy Stone makes some really good drones and I would suggest taking a look at a lot of them. But if you're looking to spend like under $100 for just a quick drone that you can play with, this is a drone. This is really interesting. That camera quality is really decent for a drone this price. And I really love it. I, I really, I'm coming to appreciate it. This is my first flight, but I really appreciate what this drone is capable of. Now I'm gonna look more into this app real quick and see what other options there are for it. Okay, so this is what the controller looks like all together, just like it is with my phone and everything connected. There's a power button, there's a low and a high speed. I didn't see that before, but now it's on high and it clicks every time you switch. 
So from low to high, it does two, and from high to low, it does one. And then there's the automatic takeoff and land button. That's right here at the bottom right. Then right here, it looks like this button does an orbit me mode and another mode. I'm not too sure, but I'll have to look that up in the actual user's manual. Now this button is the camera and the video. To get a picture, you just press it once, but to get a video, you long press it. Then on the bottom of it, right here, this little trigger on the top right of your controller, that is gonna control the camera going up and down. It can, you can get a straight up picture or you can get a facing forward picture. And it's pretty interesting. So that's the controller just as it is. The clip is really sturdy. Actually, this is probably the sturdiest clip to a controller that I've had from Holy Stone. And I bought three or four of their drones now. So I am a real big fan of Holy Stone. Okay, so I've been flying with Holy Stone drones for a while now because I like how easy to use, how affordable, and how durable they really are. And for under $100, you really can't beat this drone if this is the type of drone you're looking for. One other thing I like about Holy Stone is their customer service and how reliable they have been with getting back to me with any problems that I have had. And trust me, I haven't had many problems at all with Holy Stone. Every time that I've hit contacted them they've gotten right back to me and they've been super awesome working with me through this video now through the holidays they offered me a 10 percent off discount on this holy stone hs 440 you can go right to the website right now i'll put the link in the description to how to do it but go ahead and go get you one you get 10 percent off that would make it like 80 bucks it's totally worth the buy and over this past couple years mosh mob has done a whole range of videos but one of my favorite things to do is drones i love flying drones i love working on drones it's what i see in my future it's what i see of the future drones are going to take over there's going to be drone delivery and it's going to be amazing but if there's one thing i love to talk about it's drones so when holy stone reached out to me and offered to send this to me i was more than ecstatic to give them a video so i hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, make sure you stay tuned. Check out our other videos. As I said earlier, we've got a whole range of different videos. They range from cooking to designing to everything in between. Make sure you head over to holystone.com right now. And if you're looking into buying this drone, when you go to make the purchase, make sure you enter the code MOSHMOB in the promotional section. You'll see a place to do it and you'll get 10% off right then and there. Boom.